Hey, this is Ryan from GMB. You know, the straddle press to handstand is a very cool move, but unfortunately, a lot of people out there are having problems with it. But don't fret because today, I'm gonna show you a few basic tips that are gonna help you get your press to handstand right away. Let's take a look. We don't want our hands right up against the wall, nor do we want them too far away. Find a good middle place for this. You're going to place your head against the wall at first, making sure to keep your elbow pits forward. We're going to place our shoulders against the wall. The main point in performing this movement is to make sure that we're rolling our back up the wall as we bring our legs up. We want to make sure that this is slow and controlled. In the beginning, jump. That's perfectly fine. Do that and focus on the descent. We're gradually going to bring our hands closer to the wall and focus on not jumping. But in the beginning, in order to get the initial feel of the movement, we can bring our hands a little further out away from the wall and jump up and focus on the descent. Once you have your wall presses down, we can start taking this to the floor and doing freestanding floor prep. For this we want to make sure that we lock out our arms. Same thing applies to when we were performing this against the wall. We're going to roll our back forward, making sure to round our back. We go up on our toes and we extend our legs. In the very beginning you don't need to press up. We just want to focus on getting this, this movement down, this initial prep in order to make sure that we have the position correct for when we do start to press on up to a handstand. Now we don't want our hands really far out and we don't want our hands in between our feet. Find a nice middle position that is going to be comfortable. You should already have this down because you've been focusing on the floor prep. From here we'll start off our floor prep by going and rolling our back going up on our toes. From here it's a matter of extending the legs outwards, locking the legs and then pulling the hips up as high as we can. In the beginning just focus on the straddle hold that straddle and then slowly bring your feet back to the ground. Once you get this, you can take it up one notch by bringing your feet together and then extending them outwards. At no time are you jumping in this movement. All right, so those are just some basic tips to help you to get the straddle press to handstand. Now don't forget that you've got to work diligently on this movement. This isn't something that you'll just nail overnight. Put in the work, spend quality time focusing on the basic tips I shared with you and you will get it. If you have any questions about the straddle press to handstand or any other movements that you'd like to see me cover in a quick tutorial, feel free to contact us at info at goldmetalbodies.com and we'll help you out. Thanks for watching.